Yo, what's going on family? It's Ashton. Your boy is headed to Moody Bible Institute. I'm gonna be pursuing my master's degree in pastoral studies and I'm excited. And at first, I wasn't gonna do all this like a video, but I was encouraged and reminded that it's an opportunity to allow people to invest in, in me. And that's an opportunity that's beautiful. And so what's kind of cool is like the past couple years have been crazy. Like after I graduated high school, I, I, I had the opportunity to move to Senegal, a country in West Africa, where, where I was immersed in a, a, another culture, something way different than what I was ever used to. And I realized like, wow, like one, the world is huge. And two, there's so many people who don't know about Jesus. And it, it kind of like inspired me. And then I moved back home here in Lansing and I get involved at City Life and I join the internship and I see behind the scenes of ministry and what it really looks like to, 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 to be in a church and to, to really do this stuff. And it was crazy. And something that, was, that I took away from it was like with the world being so big, I realized like, you know, I'm all passionate and excited. I'm like, I'm gonna go, I wanna change the world. But what was awesome that I learned was that the only way possible to do that is to take it one step at a time, one life at a time, to love like the world one life at a time, aka okay, love the city one life at a time. It was beautiful. It was during these formative years where I realized like this is what I wanna do with the rest of my life. Like I wanna dive into ministry, like this is what I, Ashton Lorian wants to do. Whether it's overseas or in the cities, like my heart breaks for the lost and the broken. Whether it's the fatherless child or, or, or the single parent, whether it's the whether it's the immigrant or the non-believing, whoever it is, whoever's the broken, whoever's the lost, whoever's like forgotten about, like that junk just hurts. And my heart hurts for him. But this year it hit me that to navigate through through broken people's lives and assist in broken people's lives and families and whatever that looks like, you have to first know how to navigate through your own, through your own broken life. Whether it's your mother passing in 2017 or the lacking of a father figure for the longest. Whatever the, whatever the pain, the na like whatever the hurt is, that I realized that, man, like if I wanna be doing this, like I gotta learn how to navigate through these things. And I believe that was formative for me as going forward and as I'm headed off to Moody, that like that's where I wanna be, that's the healthy mindset. So I'm excited and motivated at where I'm at currently and where God is like, what God is doing through me and where I'm gonna be going, like I'm excited. And so I'm asking you guys first to pray. Keep your boy lifted up. I want to stay connected with you guys. I want to be, you know, we're family. That's how it is. And as we know, schooling isn't cheap. And so there is a link provided that it would mean the world to me. If you had, if you had the, the opportunity to invest in me, that would mean the world. But there's no pressure for real. The funds would be going to, to offset in scholarships. And yeah, your boy got some scholarships and that's crazy. Now, nah, but it'll be helping out books and, and just living expenses in Chicago. It would, yeah, it would be crazy. Thank you for believing me and helping shape what God is doing in me and through me. Thank you. I'm grateful for the moments I get with every single one of you guys. I'm grateful, grateful, grateful. Love you guys. We all technically moving to Moody. So basically, you just packing up with me. Let's go. Appreciate you. Love you. See you soon. What? Split. <laughs> That's crazy. I finally split it, bro. Dude, on video. <laughs> Three years in the making. That's insane. <laughs>